hi my dear viewers welcome back to my channel in today's video we will learn how to multiply simple fractions whether they are like fractions or unlike fractions the method of multiplication of the fractions simple fractions is same here i have written first example that is 3 by 7 into 2 by 4 so to multiply these two fractions what we have to do is simply multiply the numerators of both fractions and write it in the numerator that is 3 2s are 6 and multiply the denominators and write it in the denominator now here we got 6 by 28 after multiplication now because 6 by 28 is not our final answer here we can simplify it to get the final answer so in the table of 2 after simplification we will get 3 by 14 as our simplest final answer now let us solve the next example so for question number 2 I am taking the fractions 2 by 5 into 1 1 by 3 so our first fraction is 2 by 5 and the second fraction is 1 by 3 so by multiplying the numerators 2 into 1 we get 2 in the numerator and by multiplying the denominators 5 into 3 we get 15 in the denominator so our answer is 2 by 15 2 by 15 itself is our final answer because it cannot be simplified any further now let us go to next example for next example i will be taking three fractions together so first fraction i have taken 1 by 7 into 2 by 3 into 4 by 9 now here i have taken three fractions so the method of multiplication here also is same we have to multiply all the three numerators to get the numerator of our answer that is 1 into 2 into 4 and we have to multiply all the denominators to get our denominator of the answer that is 3 7 into 3 into 9 now by multiplying all the numerators we will get 8 in the numerator and by multiplying all the denominators that is 7 into 3 into 9 we will get 189 in the denominator now here itself we will stop this itself is our final answer because it cannot be further simplified so this is how we can do multiplication of fractions whether they are proper fractions or improper fractions the method of multiplication here is same now let us solve some more examples our first example is 1 by 2 into 2 by 4 which gives 2 in the numerator and 8 in the denominator after cancelling 2 by 8 in the table of 2 we will get 1 by 4 that will be our final answer next question is 4 by 5 into 1 by 7 by multiplying numerators 4 into 1 we get 4 in the numerator and by multiplying the denominators 5 into 7 we get 35 in the denominator so 4 by 35 is our answer next question's answer is 2 by 3 to the 6 after cancelling we will get 1 in the numerator and 3 in the denominator so 1 by 3 is the answer here next question's answer is we get 1 in the numerator and 9 in next question is 1 by 2 into 5 by 8 which gives us 5 in the numerator and 2 yards are 16 in the denominator next question's answer is 2 divided by 6 6 are 36 so we got 2 by 36 after simplifying 2 by 36 in the table of 2 what we will get 2 1s are 2 and in the denominator 2 18s are 36 so our answer is 1 by 18 the next question's answer is 4 by 15 next question's answer is 2 2s are 4 we will get 4 in the numerator and 8 4s are 32 we will get 32 in the denominator after simplifying 4 by 32 
we will get one four is a four and eight four is a thirty two. So our final answer after simplification is one by eight. The next question's answer is three four is a twelve and in the denominator we will get six six is a thirty six. After simplifying twelve by thirty six in the table of twelve, we will get one divided by one twelve is a twelve. And three twelves are thirty-six. So our final answer is one by three. Similarly, in next question we will get fifteen in the numerator and nine yards are seventy-two. That will be our denominator. So here final answer itself is fifteen by seventy-two. So this is how we can do multiplication of fractions, proper fractions or improper fractions. Thank you for watching.